In the kitchen. Hi, you. I'm glad you got your stuff in. You look nice. Thank you. I missed you so much. Hey, okay, I'm sorry. I know I'm late. I'm late. I'm sorry. Can I help? Mm -mm. Please? Mm -mm. Let me help, please. Tell me I'm poor. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. It was my turn to cook dinner. How was your day? Um, it was all right. How was yours? It's fine. Nothing special. Oh. What? Look. Whoa, Jen and Lily made it official? Yes, they look so cute together. Do you remember when I fucked Jen but then hated it so then I invited Lily to our gay movie night fully knowing that they would get along? Damn, I'm good. <laughs> okay. What? Are you jealous? No. What? We've been together for how long? I'm sorry, why is this relevant? Just answer the question, babe. Two years. That's right. Two years. And you hate when I post about you, and I can count on one hand how many times you've said a single thing about me. They've been together for, what, two days? And you're fawning over their social media PDA? Are you seriously getting upset over the amount of times that I post you on my Instagram? No, Ren, it's not about that. You just, you get uncomfortable when I post us with like a cute caption. It makes me feel like you don't want people to know that we're together or that I love you. Maybe that's because when you post us, it's not about us. It's about how many likes you get. I'm sorry I don't want all of our personal moments blasted on social media. I want your fucking trophy wife. Are you kidding me? That's how you feel? <coughs> are you even happy being with me anymore? I'm allowed to like other relationships that are different than ours. I'm just saying you created the rules to this open relationship. Yeah, and you agreed to them. I didn't put a gun to your head. You said you wanted to. I wanted. Because I want to be with you. Nice catch. You know, clearly you're having a lot of fun that you wouldn't be having if it wasn't for my rules. So, are you happy being with me? Yeah. That's believable. No, Ren! Hey, can we talk about this? How is this fair? Was she good? Oh my god, Ren. You're the one who made this an open relationship. And you get mad at me when I act on it, but if I don't, then I'm too reliant on you, claiming that every fucking queer relationship is too codependent and toxic. I can't win with you. I'm not the one that's coming home in the middle of the night with my makeup all fucked up. Don't be a mess, maybe. It's, it's, it, it's about consideration. Oh my God, please. Yeah, that's the problem. So if I came home with my lipstick all perfect, then you wouldn't have picked this fight? Oh my God, you don't no. get it. You don't get it. A week ago, you had a huge ass bruise in your thigh and I didn't say anything about while we were fucking. <laughs> what, are you amused with yourself? Can you take this seriously for once? Okay, okay. Please, please, please come here. 
here, please. I'm sorry. I know, I'm sorry. I wasn't fair. Maybe I was projecting. I'm sorry too. I didn't have to react that way. I really should have been more thoughtful. It's okay. I hate it when we fight over stuff like this. Me too. Hey, I missed you. Yeah, I missed you too. Like so much. That was the lipstick that we wore on our first date. So I'm just a little bit possessive over it. Babe. God, you are so fucking beautiful. <laughs> are you serious? You know I know how lucky I am, right? I love you. So much. This is high, by the way. Ah! Oh my god. Oh my god, your drums. Oh no. How long has it been there? <laughs> Must have left a year. <laughs> yeah, I actually saw her before. She went to a meeting. Mm. AA? Okay. Did she divorce him yet? I don't know. When is she still now? Ren. What? They're best friends. She's not gonna divorce him. Anyways, she's probably doing pretty good right now. I got her a little something to take care of herself. <laughs> no, you did not. Yeah. Oh my god, I would give anything to see her face. Ew, why? Oh, oh my god. Oh, Ew. yes. Oh, I have an orgasm for 15 years. Oh, yes. Oh my god, where have you been my whole life? Oh, no. I have a <laughs> Thank you for that visual. You're welcome. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> so, my mom asked about you today. Oh yeah? Mm -hmm. I didn't know she knew I was real considering I haven't met her yet. I talk about you to her babe all the time. Mm -hmm. She asked what we were doing for our two year anniversary. What? That's so cute, she remembers. <laughs> what did you say? I can't tell you. Wait, why? It's a surprise. Oh no. What oh no? Oh no. Oh, no. Did, did you? you? No, we actually would. Oh my God. We literally got each other matching dildos last year. I recall. <laughs> Best tradition ever. God, I fucking love us. <laughs> okay, well, I was going to have it be a surprise, but now that we know we both got each other something, and it's okay. <laughs> Stay right here. Don't move. Yes, ma'am. Mm -hmm. Close your eyes. Okay, they're closed. No peeking. Okay. Uh huh. <laughs> I see you. I'm not peeking. Hands out. Eyes open. Wait, plane tickets? Mm hmm. To where? 
New Orleans. Yeah. Yeah. We've been saying that we want to go together and I can meet your mom and your sister and you can take me to all of the best bars and we can see all the music and... Babe, I just don't think right now is a good time. Why not? It's just not. I mean, I can't just take a week off of work. And I thought we were going to go in the fall. Also, it feels more like an engagement trip, not an anniversary trip. You say that like it's a bad thing. This just feels more like a trip for you than us. Okay, I'll see if I can cancel if you're so against it and me meeting your mom. Oh my god, this has nothing to do with you meeting my mom. What is it about then? Us! It's about you and I never being on the same page. You literally just said how in sync we are. About fucking dildo. Well, maybe that's because I am the only one investing in us and you stopped months ago. I can't do this anymore. Are you serious? We've been pretending like this has been working for months now. No, I haven't been pretending. I have been trying. That's the thing, we shouldn't have to try, it should just be. I love you so much, Sage. We can work through this. I, no, I actually like being open. I do. Don't lie to yourself. And, and you know that's not the point. You are the sweetest, most thoughtful person that I've ever met. And, and I've been able to watch you grow into this confident, beautiful, sexy woman. And I've been able to witness that. Do you know how lucky I feel? Please, please do not patronize me right now. See that? You would have never said that before. You stick up for yourself. Yet somehow when it comes to me, you like feel like you need to prove something. I am trying to prove something to you. You make me feel like I need to. You make me feel... I don't challenge you enough. Not in the way that you need. I never have. No. I should go.